one of chemistry classes in this video i am going to discuss about intermediate first year chemistry topic hydrocarbons so this in this hydrocarbons topic i am going to discuss about preparation methods of benzene what is benzene and various preparation methods for the preparation of benzene will be discussed in my previous videos i have discussed about alkenes alkenes and alkynes various preparation methods and their chemical properties were discussed and these hydrocarbons topic is one of the important topic in intermediate public examination point of view thank you for watching trinod chemistry classes please like the video share and subscribe the channel in my previous videos also i have discussed hydrocarbons means the compounds containing carbon and hydrogen are called hydrocarbons compounds containing carbon and hydrogen are called so called as also called as hydrocarbons and hydrocarbons are classified into two types one is open chain compounds or aliphatic compounds and second one is cyclic compounds or closed chain compounds cyclic compounds or closed chain compounds hydrocarbons so these are classified into open chain compounds and closed chain compounds these open chain compounds are also called as aliphatic compounds and closed chain compounds are also called as cyclic compounds cyclic compounds these cyclic compounds are again subdivided into two types one is carbocyclic and second one is heterocyclic so carbocyclic means the ring forming elements if the ring forming elements all our carbons then it is called carbocyclic along with carbon if any other hetero atom such as oxygen sulfur if these are nitrogen are present then it is called heterocyclic compound so these carbocyclic compounds again classified into two types one is alicyclic compounds and second one is aromatic second one is aromatic compounds so Uh, we are discussing about uh, aromatic hydrocarbons we are discussing about uh, aromatic hydrocarbons so these aromatic hydrocarbons are also known as erenes also known as erenes these aromatic hydrocarbons are also known as erenes so these aromatic hydrocarbons are also known as erenes and uh, uh, these uh, class of compounds these class of compounds why they are calling it aromatic means uh, the most of the aromatic compounds as most of them possess pleasant odor pleasant odor so these class of compounds were named was named as aromatic compounds as most of them possess pleasant water most of them possess pleasant water so in greek terminology in greek terminology aroma means aroma means pleasant smell aroma means pleasant smell so based on they as they possess pleasant smell they are calling as a aromatic compounds that's why the class of compound was named as aromatic compounds and uh, in most of the aromatic compounds most of the aromatic compounds contain benzene ring most of the aromatic compound contain benzene ring and benzene is the highly unsaturated highly unsaturated hydrocarbon highly unsaturated hydrocarbon and its molecular formula is c6h6 and its molecular formula is c6h6 but even though it is highly unsaturated 
it never lose its unsaturation never lose its unsaturation but its unsaturation is retained unsaturation is retained so i have already told most of the aromatic compounds contains benzene ring but very few are aromatic compounds do not contain benzene so those aromatic compounds which contain benzene ring are called benzenoids and doesn't do not contain benzene are called non benzenoids non benzenoids so regarding benzene in 1825 michael faraday isolated the benzene in 1825 michael faraday isolated the benzene and its molecular formula is c6 h6 c6 h6 Uh, in my uh, in the previous topics we have discussed alkenes alkenes alkynes so molecular formula of benzene molecular formula of benzene do not ac didn't account for the did not didn't account for its relationship to corresponding alkenes alkenes and alkynes so we know that the general formula of alkynes is cn h2n minus 2 alkenes is cn h2n cn h2n and alkynes is cn h2n minus cn sorry this is plus 2 and this is alkynes is cn h2n minus 2 so the molecular formula didn't account for its relationship with the corresponding alkenes alkenes and alkynes so uh, without discussing the structure of benzene straight away i am entering into the preparation methods so these preparation methods and chemical properties are important in intermediate public examination point of view so first we will discuss the preparation methods and chemical properties later on we can discuss its structure so the first method is from acid so already this method was discussed in the alkynes chemical properties when acetylene gas is when acetylene gas is passed through red hot copper tube or iron tube red hot copper tube or iron tube cyclic polymerization reaction occurs and benzene is formed when acetylene gas is passed through red hot copper tube or iron tube cyclic polymerization reaction occurs and benzene is formed cyclic polymerization reaction occurs and benzene is formed c2 gives to when this is acetylene gas passed through red hot copper tube or iron tube red hot copper tube or iron tube benzene is formed benzene is formed so here what is happening is so this is a cyclic and three molecules right so what is happening is here so this bond is polarizing like this and this bond is polarizing like this this bond is polarizing like this and then we are getting benzene we are getting benzene right so here the cyclic polymerization when alcohol vapors are passed over passed over red hot copper tube benzene is formed so 3 c2h2 gives rise to c6h6 3 c2h2 gives rise to c6h6 so this is the first method for the preparation of so second method is the decarboxylation of aromatic acids decarboxylation of aromatic acids when sodium or potassium salts of sodium or potassium salts of benzoic acid are heated with the soda like yeah when or uh, when sodium or sort of uh, when sodium or potassium salts of carboxylic acid when sodium or potassium salts of benzoic acid 
is heated with soda lime gives benzene gives benzene so here we know that so this is the benzoic acid this is called benzoic acid and when treated with sodium or sodium hydroxide or potassium or potassium hydroxide sodium salts of benzoic acid so this is called sodium benzoic sodium benzoic when sodium benzoic when sodium benzoic is treated with soda lime so soda lime means the mixture of naoh and coo is called soda lime treated with when sodium salts of benzoic acid are treated with soda lime forms benzene forms benzene right when sodium salts of sodium salts of benzoic acid on heating on treatment with soda lime gives benzene gives benzene so this is the second preparation method for the preparation of benzene then the third method is from phenol from phenol when phenol vapors are passed over heated zinc when phenol vapors are passed over heated zinc benzene is formed benzene is formed so we know that so this is called phenol if benzene ring contains oh group the class of compounds are called phenols when phenols vapors are when phenol vapors are passed over passed over zinc passed over zinc when phenol vapors are passed over zinc passed over zinc benzene is formed benzene is formed when phenol vapors are passed over when phenol vapors are passed over heated zinc benzene is formed so these are the three methods one is cyclic polymerization of alkynes that is acetic then second one is decarboxylation then third one is reduction of phenols reduction of phenols so when phenol vapors are passed over that they these are the three methods for the preparation of benzene thank you for watching trinath chemistry classes please like the video share and subscribe the channel